the big advantage of uh, PetiGuard uh, f compared to other uh, navigation systems is that it's very uh, easy to use. Uh, the learning curve is quite um, um, quickly. You, ca you get uh, real-time information uh, where you are in the bone, thanks uh, the conductivity system, which allows you to know if you are uh, in cortical or in cancellous bone, or even if you're making a, a breach in your, in your bone. We have in the tip, there's a sensor which measures the conductivity. It's easy to, to understand that the conductivity of cortical bone is not as high as cancellous bone, and even higher is the conductivity of fluids. That's why we have a, this beep tone coming from the pedicard is very mild, very low. Um, in, in cortical bone, it's getting to an intermediate uh, sound and frequency or cadence when you are in, um, in, in cancellous bone. And then if you, if you do a bridge, you're going to have a high uh, frequency of sound. If it happens that you're going too medial or too lateral, you're going to have a low sound and then you know before you get the high signal of the bridge, you can go back, reorient it and go into the pedicle. The information you're getting, first of cancellous bone and then maybe even if you don't make a bridge and you go to the cortical and you, you find your sound is going down and you want to reorient, when you're coming back, you're going to here, this typical fluid connectivity sound, which goes very high, the same as a bridge, but now you know it cannot be a bridge. It's only the, the blood coming from your perforation. So when you redirect and again go forward, you're going to have a normal cancellous bone tone.